All right, let me walk you through how to get the Gallipoli world into Minecraft Education Edition. So I've downloaded the files from the from my website. Um, so I'll just right click and let's extract those. All right, so here they are. Now what we're going to do first is copy the Anzac resources zip file into the uh, resources location for Minecraft. So I'll just open up another window so we can keep this here. Okay, now the location we want to copy that to is actually hidden. So the first thing to do is in the View tab, click Hidden Items up here. Now we can browse. So it's on this PC. You want to go to your hard disk uh, under your username. So find your username. Alrighty, so this is the app data folder. Let's head into here. We want roaming and Minecraft Education Edition games com.mojang resource packs all right this is the spot here so I've got that written down but you can see most of it up in here so let's just copy that paste it into that folder done all right second thing to do let's just double click on this this uh, gallipoli.mc pack is the skin pack so if you just double click on that minecraft education edition will open and it'll import that skin pack import started successfully imported great okay now when a skin pack comes in you probably know you can click on the hanger down here and if I scroll down to the bottom we'll see the Gallipoli skin pack so there I can choose uh, you know from different characters that they made all right the last thing we'll do is import the world so we'll go back to our files here if we just double click on the Gallipoli world skin pack just bounce back to Minecraft. Okay, it's imported the world, generating the world. All right, so here we are. We're in the uh, in the world. Let me just fly up and around here. So this is the world. It was made for or made by the um, Auckland Museum. Um, I haven't really had the chance to explore it at all, but. Uh, Hopefully if you follow those instructions, everything should be okay and you can get into it. I haven't changed my skin yet. I can see up top from there. So let's just escape, save out of there. But there it is. So that's all done for um, the Minecraft Education Edition on a computer. I haven't even looked at how you would set that up on a iPad. But um, something else to remember is that if you're doing any multiplayer games that Every user is going to need the resource pack and the skins, I believe, put onto their device. So, yeah, if I get the chance, I'll have a look and see how I can do it on an iPad. But, uh, yeah, otherwise, there you go. Um, uh, that's pretty much how it's done.